I am here to give them what they want to know and give it to them on the most real level I possibly can. You know, because even though I've had a really big time experience with cameras and lights, it's like I'm still an average everyday person. And that's why when I speak and when I blog and when I Twitter, it's about real things that real people go through. So, and I think that's why a lot of people relate. When I left The Biggest Loser Ranch, it was my mission to share what I've learned with anybody who's willing to listen because I've, I've learned so much about myself. I've not only about diet and exercise and you know how to lose weight, but just a lot about real life situations. And so I knew because of where I came from, if I am able to change and if I've been able to make progress like I've made in my life, I know that there are people out there who are struggling that can make that same progress. There was a moment for me where, well, even bef like before I even stepped foot on the ranch, one of the show's creators, J.D. Roth, had sat all the contestants down in a hotel room to have a conversation with us about what we were about to experience and what we were about to go through and what we were about to do. And the biggest thing that he said to me was, flip the switch. You know, flip that switch, you know, make the change, you know, you've got an opportunity here to change your life. And in all reality, that's when my life started to change. Not when I stepped foot on the ranch and got on the treadmill, sitting in a room listening to someone speak who was so powerful and had such a strong message. So then it ignited a fire within me to, to try to reach as many people as I possibly could. Because if the power of someone's words can make somebody else take action, and if, if people have watched my story unfold in the, you know, the public spotlight, and if I have the opportunity to reach more people, then that's why I want to speak. You know, I could be in a room full of 15,000 people and if I could touch one person in that room, that's all I ask for. And it doesn't necessarily mean that they have to, you know, walk out. But if I, if I can make someone think, you know, man, I can change my life or I can do that one thing that I've always wanted to do, then I couldn't ask for anything more.